Yo, what's going on guys? It's Thomas from RomerFitness.com and in today's video, I'm going to be sharing with you a recent push workout that I did. So we're starting it off strong here with the incline barbell bench press. I hit a new record here. I did 215 for three reps and I'm doing this reverse pyramid training style. So I'm going to be starting with the heaviest weight I can possibly do, which in this case is 215. Then I'm going to slightly decrease the weight down to 205 and I'm going to increase the reps. So in this instance, for set number two, I'm doing 205 for five reps. And then as you're about to see in the last set, I do two, uh, or excuse me, 195 for six reps. So reverse pyramid training is a really good way to help increase the weight on any of your main key compound lifts. So try that style of training, not just for your bench press, but your other key lifts like squats, for example, or bent over rows, pull-ups, things like that. It's a really good way to increase strength on those exercises fast. Now, the next exercise that I did is the one arm lateral raise. So I just hold on to something for support and then just simply do a lateral raise one arm at a time. And this is a great exercise to help increase the amount of weight that you do on the lateral raise. You will be the strongest uh, with this exercise in this position. And it really all comes down to progressive overload. So yes, I am using a little bit of momentum here. I could work on that a bit for sure, but the main thing I wanted to focus on was just progressive overload, simply adding more weight over time. And this is gonna be a really good exercise to do that, you know, to help broaden out the shoulders, work on that lateral head and build that capped shoulder look. So definitely give this one a try in your next routine if you're not currently doing it. And then the final exercise we have in this workout is the simple V-bar pushdown. I find that I am strongest uh, when using the V-bar attachment for this exercise. It's just a simple isolation exercise for the triceps here. You will notice I'm letting my elbow swing up a little bit too much. I'm using a little bit too much momentum, not doing a very good job of controlling it on the negative portion of the exercise here. So yes, that's another thing I could improve on here. But again, this exercise, very simple, very minimalist, only three exercises. It's, a, it's still important to do military presses and, you know, bent lateral raises or something that's going to help work on the rear delt. So you could certainly incorporate those exercises into the workout as well if you so like to and that is pretty much going to be it for the video if you liked it be sure to give it a thumbs up and also while you're at it go ahead and hit that subscribe button so that way you can stay up to date with my latest tips and videos and other than that i'll be talking to you next time peace